The Middle Eastern owner of Ebbsfleet United has revealed plans to build a theme park to rival Disneyland Paris. Dr Abdullah al Khumaidi wants to transform nearby Wasteland into a wonderland that the club says will create thousands more jobs. Here's our sports reporter Amy Lewis. Millions has been spent on this club and the team are on the verge of fulfilling their part of the owner's master plan. How much of a boost do you think the promotion would be for the people living nearby? Oh, it's huge. You know, with, with all the things that's going on in and around the area, you know, to have a, a big football club, you know, competing in the league at league level, you know, would be huge. And we're, we're just the first stage of that. The real transformation will take place over the road. The football club's owner wants to turn this wasteland into a wonderland, a theme park that would rival Disneyland Paris with 50 rides, a theatre and hotels. The result will be twice the size of the Olympic Park in East London. The developers say 15 million people would use it every year. They want to open it in 2022. The club claim it would bring 27,000 jobs to an area with high unemployment. Locals are concerned about traffic congestion, but the majority support the plans. I think it's good for the community. It gives our youngsters, instead of having to go abroad, they've got it all at hand. More houses, more work, can't be bad, can it really? And it's an area that's been derelict for 50 years. 15,000 new homes are already being built nearby to create Ebbsfleet Garden City. And £11 million is being spent on new stands at the football club. Its owner, Kuwaiti businessman Dr Abdullah, will find out in November if he can build the theme park. Are you concerned that if the resort here doesn't get the go-ahead, then the owner will pull out from the football club? No, I don't think that's going to happen at all. I think they're two completely separate projects. Um, he's committed to it for the long term. Not a penny of it is going in as loans. It's all equity. Um, and he's very committed to, to the football club. Ebb's fleet are just three games away from potential promotion. They hope that's just the start of the club's adventure. Amy Lewis, ITV News.